here for sure. Okay. So I'm going to try and do this entire video live because it's Christmas season and I like love Christmas. I've banned working. Tom has broken the working no, no, band. Nova said that nobody's allowed to work on Christmas until, of course, Nova wants to shoot a reaction video. <laughs> now everybody has to work on Christmas. But we are going to do it so that we're not going to edit it. I got my little buttons set up so that I can uh, hopefully, oh, we're going to be subject to an ad. Um, oh, yeah. Monetizing that one, baby. <laughs> okay, so what have we been doing for Christmas? We've done so many cute things. Okay, tell my, people my, how serious I am, though, first. Like, I'm serious. Nova's very very serious about Christmas. She doesn't want to do anything that's not Christmas-related. She wants to make sure that everything is very... <laughs> everything has to be recreational and extracurricular. There can be, there can be no serious business or work done. <laughs> I break that rule. <laughs> Tom and breaks I, the work rule. And I released the video that we're about to react to together. But I am like a cop when it comes to like saving Christmas movies because Tom likes to burn through them all the second we get to December. And I limit the screen time of Christmas movies. I start crafting the second um, yeah. there's, December there's, happens. There's, you know, I've made the dogs all low budget, sweaters. There's low budget Christmas movies and then there's the high, there's very few and far between high budget Christmas movies. So all the high budget ones. The um the new one with Will Ferrell and, and Ryan Reynolds, the the one with Jason Momoa. Just handout promo on my the, channel. The sequel to Christmas, Christmas story. story, the last episode of Santa Claus with Tim Allen. Nova's been those are off limits until today, which is the twenty third. Now we can the start Eve of we're, Eve. we're close enough to Christmas that we can start watching the high budget Christmas movies and stop watching the fucking Hallmark Christmas movies. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them about the dog sweaters. I have made all the dog sweaters. I taught myself to crochet. Made them all sweaters. They're not in them right now. They're not wearing them right now. Because we do still live in California. Yeah. So, um, we made each other's heads as ornaments. That was my favorite part. Yeah. I don't know if you guys saw that, but I haven't posted it on Instagram yet. Uh, did you post it? Mm-hmm. It's on my Not Nova Rockefeller Instagram. I got to post it on uh, Instagram because Nova and I made... Uh, should I just go get him? I can be real fast. But I'm, I'm trying not to okay, edit it. Okay, forget it. I'll show you guys on Instagram. We made, Maybe I'll add the photo or something. We made Christmas ornaments of each other's faces, and they're hanging on the top of our tree right now, and they're hilarious. My head is so big that it's going to pull over the tree. Mm -hmm. It literally looks like it's leaning over. Um, And I'm actually, you know what I've thought is I'm going to be really pissed off if that a Christmas story movie is bad, and it's probably going to be bad because it's a sequel made like 30 years later. Meh, who cares? So is the Santa Claus, and Santa Claus is great. But I've saved it for Christmas Day. So I'm going to be pissed. Okay, but Tom wrote, wrote, a, wrote a love song about me. I did. That's what we're here for. We're here to react to that. I didn't mention that. I'm See, I'm in the Christmas zone. I don't want to do the work. We're going to react to my new video, Ghost. It's a love song that I wrote for Nova. And, and I directed the video. And Nova directed the video. Someone, what was that comment someone said? It was really funny. I didn't see Nova's name on the end of the video. She didn't want to take all the credit from the <laughs> tripod. <laughs> so I forgot to do that. All right. Let's see what we got here. Let's get it. I've seen a hundred grand in cash. I've took the trip to hell in. Have you seen a hundred grand in cash? Oh, yeah. Many times. We're doing a fact check fucking reaction. Many, many times. <laughs> Back, I've been around, never saw nothing like you. What is it about me that you've never seen nothing like? Your head. <laughs> I've never seen the, I've never seen the, uh, the head to body ratio <laughs> that you possess. And I've seen lights up in the sky and I've seen ghosts alone at night. I've seen some things, but they were nothing like till I walk through walls. I walk through walls. I want to be with you. Oh, <laughs> so cute, man. Okay, <laughs> shooting this video was hilarious because we're such doorknobs. I look so handsome right there. Ugh, you're so annoying. Are you trying I to don't replicate look like it? That. Yeah, why? Yeah, because I lit you. I'm ugly in real life. I know. 
so are you. That's not true. <laughs> I, I radiate. I radiate amazing energy, right? Yeah. That's what's so great about me. So I might just be like a potato, but I'm like a glowing potato. Mm hmm You texted yourself Yo. over there. What? Don't annoy me or you might become a mashed potato. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just for the record, not only have I seen 100 grand in cash, I've also seen butterflies and babies cry. Look how attractive we are there. And then... I lit, I lit it so my head was smaller. Okay, also, your parents were there the entire time we were filming this. Yeah. So we were acting like total doorknobs, and then, like, we'd have, like, I'd be like, okay, we need more serious shots. So we'd go from, like, humping air and doing finger guns. To mm -hmm. like snuggling. Yep. All in front of your parents. I think they understand me a little differently now. They had a blast. They had so much fun. <laughs> I've seen the country far and wide. I meet my heroes all the time. I've been around, never saw nothing like you. And I've held diamonds in my hands. I've got a couple million fans. I met some folks, but they were nothing like till I walked through all. That was awful. What? I have like crazy me a asthma. Piggyback? Yeah. Try giving you a piggyback. Oh my. <laughs> Fucking like it's top heavy. It's like it's like it's like strapping a light post to your back and then putting a whale on top of it. <laughs> there was a. There, I have a shot of me I was like, like dragging trying to you say around that, like your head, head is yeah. really heavy. Got yeah. it. I think it, just, it, it sounded like I just called you fat, but I don't think you're fat. I just think you have a massive fucking head. Thank you. I love you. With you. Things I swear to God that I still can't believe. Don't tickle me! I forgot to get you back for that. Trust me, you're always getting me back. You're so annoying. I'm annoying? Yeah. You are <laughs> Stop! Me? Annoying? <laughs> Impossible. Don't mess it up. I've got my eczema shield on. That's <laughs> full. Did you really spit in that? Why would that be annoying if I did? <laughs> Tell me you didn't. I didn't. I don't see any spit, but like, I went, honestly, I like this. disgusting. That's what I did. I'm so glad you're balancing out the nice thing you did for me, which is writing this song. It's all about yin and yang, baby. <laughs> I've been bothering you so much about, about when you first realized I was so special. <laughs> Well, so much, like late at night, two o'clock in the morning. I think, I think they marked it on your birth certificate that you were special. <laughs> Top if you know it. what I mean. Stop it. No, but like, because I remember the first time I saw you, I tell you at least once a week. I know. <laughs> I remember because you emailed me and you said, can, can I be on your rap show? Because nobody would let me on the rap shows in our hometown. You want to you know, so, uh, you know, know a secret? I threw my own rap show, yes. I spent about mm, about 18 hours uh, last week looking for those emails. Oh, I have them. You do? Yeah. Because I can't find them anywhere. I was going to have them framed and I was going to give them to you for Christmas because it was the first time that we ever communicated. That's so funny. No, they're in. But uh, I couldn't find them anywhere. Facebook. You messaged me on Facebook. No, I sent you an actual email. I oh, I definitely have that because my emails have been absolutely ridiculous forever. Yeah, I sent you an actual email with my songs in it. Throw your drink at the DJ. Something about being from the north side. <laughs> and. Yeah. That, that's all I remember. Oh. What? 
Siri set an alarm oh for God. 15 minutes for Butcher. Done. Um, because I remember the first time I saw you. The I first remember. time you saw me? Yeah, because I was... was the first time you saw me? Okay. I was meeting you to go put out posters uh -huh. on White App for the show. And I think the show might have been that night. Or, or, like, the day after I think it was that night. Because I used to go out right before the show. I'd go out for weeks and, like, hand out flyers personally and tell people, like, I'm having a rap show. I would hand out 2,500 flyers per show. Like, I was, like, insane about it. And then the night before, I wanted my poster to be, like, the top poster right at eye level all along the app. So I'd hit every single thing and poster right at eye level. So, like, if you were heading that way, you pretty much knew that there was a show going on. So I, you met up with me. I almost come, didn't show up. Really? Yeah, because I was a pro wrestler at the time. And one of the things that we did in pro wrestling constantly was put up posters in the freezing friggin' cold in Edmonton, all down 118 Ave, putting posters up, putting posters up, wrestling show tonight, da 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 da. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I had got to a point in wrestling where I no longer had to be on the poster team anymore. It was the younger kids and the newbies that were doing the posters. Yeah. And it was like a big moment for me, like, sick. I don't have to go out there in the snow and put up posters. And then I hit you up and I said, da 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 da, can I be on the show? You said, some of your music, da da da, that all went down. And then you hit me up and said, Oh, I need you to come help me put up posters. And I was like, this bitch. But it was me. Like, I, I felt was like you were treating up. me like one of those little dorky new wrestlers. And I was like, I'm not going to put up fucking posters. And then hey. I thought better of it. And I was like, you know what? I am the new kid on the block as far as this rap shit goes. So I'll go up and put a couple posters. I'll spend 15 minutes there doing it. And then I'll fuck off. But I did it all myself. So it wasn't like that crazy. I'm not like you go put up posters. I put up some posters that day, Nova. You did not do it all yourself because you requested my presence and <laughs> I showed least, up and put up posters. Okay, but at least I didn't put you on the flyer squad because a I lot of the I don't even think you put me on the poster and I put them up. Yeah, I did. I put you on the poster. Uh, it was called like Remember, Remember, Remember the 5th of November, which is crazy that that was the show that we did together because that was like the fucking anonymous movie. And that show was called Remember, Remember the 5th of November. Have you ever thought about that? Well, the anonymous movie that you're referring to, it's not the anonymous movie. It's called V for Vendetta. Yeah, that's you now. You're the vendetta. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> but back to, I remember the first time I saw you because you came out to do that with me, but also you're lucky that I didn't put you on the flyer squad because while the show's going on, Wait, I also have flyer people, squad. Yeah. That's why my shit was always packed while it was going on. I'd have like five people with flyers on, on the app saying there's a show going on right now. Go. My shit was cracking. Flyer I'm squad. giving away my fucking, that's tight. I'm giving away my secrets. But yeah, yeah no, for, we did for anybody thing. out there that's uh, thinking about throwing a show, the big secret to having <laughs> it do well is to have people hand out flyers to the show. No, but they have to be certain people because you have to like sometimes physically walk them into the bar. That's why my shit was always cracking. I used to have like bar, hip hop bar nights and stuff. And I would go out on the app, find 10 people that were partying and be like, you should come to my party. It's way better. And then I bring them to my party and then I go out to find more people and drag them in because I got a cut of the bar. Yeah. I actually kind of remember you doing that. We are going to go get me some money. Come to my bar. First round's on me. <laughs> I was like that sleazy promoter. Yeah. I think I was probably one of the only girl promoters that existed in Edmonton. <laughs> probably. But I remember the first time I saw you. Right. First time you saw me. You were looking down and you were walking out of the, the Monkey Island. Like we were meeting there and you were walking out of the bar to come meet me and you were looking down. I think you were wearing a hat or something. And then you looked up and I saw in your little eyes and I was like, oh my God. I was like, that is the, he is amazing looking. So gorgeous. Like I was like, he's so gorgeous. And I saw the actual look in your eyes. And the first words I thought were like, oh my God, that man is pure danger. <laughs> I was like, he's dangerous. So... I sloughed you off pretty much because you, you thought I was pretty great right away. And I sloughed you off for years because mm -hmm. I was like, you're a, no, <laughs> I, was like, I was like, he will absolutely break Every my Every time I tried to hang out with you, you gave me some excuse why you couldn't. <laughs> I even went to go meet you places and then you text me and be like, oh, just left there. Sorry. <laughs> On White Ave. Yeah. 
But I didn't care. I was just there to get shit faced anyway. Yeah, so. like White Ave is a party no matter what. Oh, I miss White Ave. I, I miss don't. it so much. But yeah, I just thought you were amazing. Thought you were so pretty. But I, it's crazy because I can't think of another person whose eyes I remember looking into for the first time. But yours like always like stuck out to me like it like shattered a little piece of my heart instantly. Maybe it was love at first sight, babe. For me, I think it definitely was. I loved, I, you, I loved you the day that I met you. I told you. I thought you were so cool. I never met anybody that was cool like you before. Aww. And I think me sloughing you off for a few years like really helped as well. But then we became really good friends. And I, I knew you were the most amazing person ever when you sent me the Growing Pains video. Mm. I was just like, oh my God. He's actually talented in this sea of shit. I have found a little diamond <laughs> in the shit sea of the Canadian hip hop uh, scene. Okay, well, I've Look been... at us now. Living the dream, baby. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> living the fucking dream. I know, it's kind of crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. I remember I couldn't afford a bus fare to go poster for the shows, so I would walk for two hours from the west end of Edmonton to White Ave. Through the fucking, like, River Valley. That's why I have such a thing for the River Valley, because I, I would walk through it at 2 o'clock in the morning home from the show because I couldn't afford to take a bus or a cab or anything. Mm-hmm. <sighs> fucking crazy. Okay, well, I'm not editing any of that, so I hope we don't look stupid. Here we go. Crystal okay. balls and magic in the breeze. I've seen Paris, I've seen London. I have been weak in the knees. Ain't seen nothing that's quite like you. Till I'm a gold, 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 gold. Stuck you all my life to you And when I'm a gold, gold, gold I will always be your boo Till it burns down till the are, you doing, are you doing interpretive dance over here? I'm doing sign language World dance, You don't know sign language Till my last <laughs> breath Till I leave town, till there's nothing <laughs> left, till I'm in the ground, till I'm a ghost. I'll give all my life to you. <laughs> I hope, I hope someone who knows sign language will, like, I don't know, duet this or Tom, something. Tom and just tell me accidentally what said that he eats spaghetti and monkey shit. <laughs> you ruined the, the clip. Why? Because you started talking over me before I was done talking. Because there's a new feature now on YouTube where you can clip a little piece of a video and respond to it, but you ruined it. So oh, there I don't was give your a chance fuck. of being viral. I don't give a fuck about you or YouTube. And just for You're that, literally I'm going to talk over everything that you say. I'm going to talk over everything you say. I'm going to talk over everything you say. We are here. Oh, little, little, little. Oh, I the new feature is never going to work now. <laughs> I'm going to do this constantly. <laughs> I just kissed you. I uh, did you unplug my headsets? Can you still hear it? Till I'm a oh no, I can't hear it. I think you've done something over here. Oh, the the cable's just sketchy. I gotta hear it. You gotta press play somewhere. Bring it back. Bring it back a little bit. <laughs> From the jump. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I just smooched you and. Uh, I hit my nose on your glasses and I got one of those zits that's like super deep inside my nose that you can't actually see. But That's it your brain. But it hurts. <laughs> you little fucker. <laughs> you fat little squirrel. No, that's what you call me now. Fat little squirrel. Okay, you have a brain pimple or something. Is this what you stopped the video to tell everyone? Well, you have I a smooched pimple you. In your nose? I smooched you and your big ass fucking weirdo nerd glasses hit me on the nose and it hurt me. Thank you for that. Scintillating. Scintillating? Yeah. Do you not know what that means? Of course I know what that means. What does it mean? Scintillating. S I N T I L. No! I L A T I N G. Scintillating. No, it has a C in it. A it's, C I N. It's, it's like a synonym. It's a synonym for titillating. What? <laughs> Don't say that word on my tongue. Tantalizing. Channel. No, Thomas. Enthralling. It's, uh, oh, I used it wrong. Oh, you used it wrong. Let me see. What does it mean? 
<laughs> to emit flashes of light or sparkle. Sparkling or shining brightly. Brilliantly and excitingly clever or skillful. Oh, I use it right. Well, kind of. That's like the scintillating wit. That's like the fifth one down, though. No, it's not. It's adjective. That's verb. Scintillate. No. The further down in the definition you get, the less likely it is that people are going (laughs) to use the word in that way. (laughs) Don't you know how to use a dictionary, Nova? I hate you. I hate (laughs) you so much. Um. Oh, I want to ask the question that everybody wants to know. Are you going to ask me to marry you? (laughs) The no. answer is yes. <laughs> no, we're not doing that on the on YouTube. Oh. We gotta save that for like a on stage and some Mariah Carey holiday special or something. Okay. No, I don't want to save that and I don't want it to be on in front of the world. Okay, promise me. I have social anxiety. I'm not but making when any are we promises. Get married? What is that the question? Yeah, everyone always asks me that, so I figured I'd just put it to you. Oh, soon. I'm really sticking it to the man. After this reaction, when we're done this. <laughs> we're just going to go get married real quick. Yeah. So let's wrap this up so we can get it going. <laughs> Till I'm a go, oh, oh, stuck here all my life. Oh, no! Yo, what the fuck, Nova? Why did you do that? I didn't mean to. Okay. Yeah, you dissed my mom. Oh, shit. You think she's going to get me back? You think she takes after her son? Wait. <laughs> Like, she's going to just... Okay, hold on. People can hear us, but they can't see us. That's my mom and my dad. (laughs) Oh, my God, I love you. So that's that's the new song, Ghost. Oh, let me just say before Nova goes on her whatever she's gonna talk download about. Download the song on iTunes. Guys. Yeah, please download we're on the, the pop charts. Please download the song Ghost on iTunes. This is the first time that we've ever been on the pop charts, um, and we're trying to take a number one in pop for the first time. So download the song on iTunes. It's called Ghost. It's by Tom McDonald, and I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, also, mm-hmm. um, holiday season. If you guys are feeling lonely or you need some more friends to hang out with, you can join my Discord, which is novasdiscord.com. We got a book club. We got an art oh, club. I had no idea Minecraft where that server. was going. I thought you were going to invite everybody to our house. house. Yeah. I was our like, address what the fuck is... are you doing right now? <laughs> uh, you also have a Discord. Yeah, I got a Discord, yeah. Uh, if you go to my Discord, they'll give you the link for it. We gatekeep. <laughs> That's a fact. <laughs> um, other than that, is there anything else you want to talk about? Um, no, I don't believe there is. Okay, well, I can't wait to get married to you in about five minutes. It's going to be so awesome. Okay, I got a few things to take care of first, but I love you. <laughs> and these doing these reactions with you is great. And Wait, tell me all the things you love about me first. This is our Just love video. Listen to the fucking song on repeat. It's the first love song you I've written in 10 years. It's the first me. song that I've written, first love song I've written in 10 years. Okay, so if you want, just listen to that. That's how much I love you. But why? Because you're smart and you're funny. And? and you make me look ridiculously good looking standing next to you. Because I'm so beautiful and people are like, wow, he must be way more handsome than he actually yes, looks. Yes, yes. I, like, just standing in your glow, babe. It just, My glow, potato glow. Your potato glow, yes. <laughs> you're smart, you're funny. You're, be- I'm you're beautiful. With the fucking you're beautiful. Case. You're talented. Yeah, baby. You make me a better person. I do. I do. I'm always saying, hey. You're a hard worker. No. Couldn't do it without you. Oh, babe. I love you so much. Mwah. Adios. Adios, amigo. Thanks for coming to my channel. Please subscribe. Oh, a quote. Hit him with a quote. Um. Do my quote. On, you don't have to be the best. You just have to do your best. What's your quote? Something about love. Okay, hold on. Are you Googling a love quote? Yeah, I'm going to get a good one. Something about loving yourself. We'll just okay, wait. Okay, how about... Um, Can I post this unedited? 
I, this is fine, right? We were good? I think so. Okay. What do you got? If love is the answer, please rephrase the question. Bye, guys. <laughs>